what's going on guys welcome back so coming off watching one of the worst episodes of vikings i've ever watched in the series i'm gonna try to pop myself up to start this new series sons of anarchy i've heard of this series before of course heard of the series but um never was interested the name does not pop out for me um, I don't know what this series is going to be about. I've seen pictures, posters of it before. I just don't, I don't want to go searching and get spoiled about anything, but I have seen posters, um, for Sons of Anarchy before, um, the jacket, the, the back of the jacket with the, with the Sons of Anarchy logo on it. Like I've seen that before. I don't know what this series is about, um, you know, but I'm hoping to find out, of course, and hopefully it's enjoyable. You guys have not steered me wrong. So if you guys have suggested Sons of Anarchy in the past, we're finally here. Um, so I knew I was. Yeah, this this has been in the suggestions for a while and we're finally here to do Sons of Anarchy. OK, so let's jump into it. I don't have much to say here. If you're new and you're a fan of Sons of Anarchy, I do not post reactions on YouTube. So you will have to go to the link in the description to go watch the reaction on the Google Drive. Um, it is a full reaction, no edits. So that should be okay. Okay, so just watch the reaction. Um, if you can't access it, if you click on it and it tells you playback limit or whatever number of plays, is as exceeded all you have to do is just wait a little bit maybe an hour maybe two to watch the reaction okay that's how we do things over here because i do not want to have to deal with the shit with getting my channel getting striked on youtube okay you can also receive strikes for links like this but it is a lesser risk it is a lesser risk okay so that's what we do over here. I used to upload stuff to YouTube or try to, and I've gotten strikes in the past and that's just what it is. That's how we do things over here. If that's not your cup of tea, that's fine. You know what I'm saying? There's plenty of other people that react to the show. You can go enjoy them, you know, but if you just indulge us, we'll show you that this way of doing things is way better for us over here. I don't get a ton of views, but I'm okay with that. You get what I'm saying? join the terror squad it's a great community over here you should join it leave a like if possible hey it is what it is thank you guys so much i will see you guys for the review okay so here we are soa sons of anarchy season one episode one now, I have to say I'm very intrigued by this series. And the reason why I am is because the storytelling so far in this one episode has really set up a lot. They've established um they have, they've established who the Sons of Anarchy are. They, that wasn't hidden. You know, at first it was a little bit confusing about who they are, you know, and what they represent, you know. But they did a very good job of throughout the episode show you who they are both when they're not committing crimes and when they are you know what i'm saying they obviously own the town you know what i'm saying they got the um the police or i want to say maybe certain police i don't want to say the entire police department i want to say just some people who are probably on the scene you know, they pay them off, whatever, so they could do that. And usually when you have crime organizations, they usually have somebody who's in on the take that, uh, that, is, that is off law enforcement. If it's going on for too long and you're wondering why aren't they being arrested, trust me, they got somebody in the police department looking out for them. And it's usually like that, whether it's in TV show or real life. You get what I'm saying? It's usually like that. If you look at the biggest crime syndicates organizations um all over the world in history when you're talking about pablo escobar you talk about um the, the american gangster you get what i'm saying like 
they usually have somebody in the police department looking out for them tell them if they're going to get raided whatever the situation is warn them you know what i'm saying they get paid for this you know what i'm saying the mexican cartel has basically the, the entire it's the i think it's the most corrupted police force in the world at this point i think so not me think it's re, it's recorded like that you can look it up for yourself um so for me it's just like don't worry guys next time i'm gonna have a background I'm just chilling on this black background right now. I just didn't want to spoil myself by looking up a wallpaper right now um, and spoil myself about anything going in. But now I can go and I can grab a poster because I know what to look for, what not to look for. You know what I'm saying? Because maybe I would have seen something that I wasn't supposed to see and by searching, you get what I'm saying? But now I can kind of gauge what I want to look for going in and searching on Google. So... Um, but anyways, um, yeah, so they've established who the sons of anarchy are and obviously they're going to have rivals. Um, I would have never thought that they would have a Latino by gang. That's not necessarily something that Latinos usually do, or is it? I don't know. I've never heard of a Latino by gang, like, not, I've never heard of that before, like that kind of caught me off guard but hey we're creating a new universe why not you know what i mean so they stole the guns the beginning of the episode and then they went back and but i guess i caught it wrong i call it wrong i'm probably gonna have to go back and check again because i did check during the episode after the intro so i did check back to see did they have on jack because because at first i was wondering didn't weren't they wearing the same jackets you guys are wearing are you stealing from yourselves what what's happening and then i went back to look and i was like oh but they are weird in the Sons of Anarchy. But then the jackets are so similar. You get what I'm saying? But it turns out the Mayans stole the guns. So I don't know if, if they were actually wearing the Sons of Anarchy um, um, jackets or they were wearing their jackets. Awfully similar is what I'm trying to say. I didn't exactly look back enough to see what was written on them. So that's why I'm still kind of a little bit confused about it. But in any case, great episode great episode they've established some things these guys are not afraid to kill they're not afraid to bribe but they're trying to toughen up jacks and there's also this other interfamily um interfamily situation that's going on that's going to create some of the drama which is the leader of the actual um s sons of anarchy right gang you know what i'm saying i'm interested to know more about jack's dad the former leader of the gang right because he had other things and it looks like is the the wife the mom that was behind everything that was like you need to do it this way not that way we were kids when we were thinking about doing it that way so now you got to grow up be a man and do what you got to do you know what i'm saying and she's doing the same thing with this new leader um as i said i don't know if Jax knows that this dude is with his mom it doesn't seem obvious it doesn't seem like Jax knows but He's trying to toughen Jax up, you know, at that point at the end of the episode when he told him, finish the guy. You know what I'm saying? He's trying to get him to come out of this comfort zone that he's in. But Jax is trying to keep a sort of purity to him. But he's still out here in the gang. He's still got to, because he's like, oh, if, if you don't toughen him up, when he becomes the leader of the gang, he's just going to tear everything down. You get what I'm saying? And make everybody soft and go into different things. But there's nothing wrong. It's kind of like reminds me of power you know what i'm saying with ghost how you know what i'm saying he was running new york for su for such a long time and now he wanted to transition out of the game there's nothing wrong with that and that's the thing about criminal organizations that i just don't understand a lot of times like you get you making all of this money and you get so greedy you can't stop and you never try to transition out and to be become a regular citizen that's how you grow if you're if, if you're gonna be, you know what i'm saying if you're gonna start something like that it, i'm not encouraging that in real life but if you are going to do it do it right man and try and with a goal of getting out at some point you know what i'm saying um because i know it's not an easy thing to do but at the same time hey man you got to do what you got to do but anyways um so in my opinion, you know, great season opener, season one, episode one. 
um and it definitely gets me interested in watching more of this show so i'm definitely going to be looking forward to seeing that hopefully i could get at least 100 people to watch this um series with me that would be cool if it's not doing great numbers and i'm not you know what i'm saying if the writing is bad or anything like that i'll probably discontinue it that's how i do things you know what i'm saying because i'm not going to sit down and torture myself to watch something that's horrible that's like i just started watching you know what i'm saying like if it's horrible off bat as i said right now it's cool it's good i love what they're doing it's star studied and i like that all the actors that i saw that i knew from other series or movies or whatever the situation is they've just they've done brilliant work so i'm for that alone puts it on another tier for me for me wanting to watch more of it um you know, so I'm just looking forward to doing that. But in any case, man, thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, if you're watching this, leave a like, leave a comment in the comment section, and also subscribe if you're new. I'm gonna still be doing this series, and as long as it keeps entertaining me, we're gonna keep we're gonna keep doing it. You get what I'm saying? The only reason why I'm trying to finish up Vikings is because I wanna see what I wanna see how they're gonna gonna end this torture that they're putting us through right now i just want to see how they're gonna end this torture if they're gonna end it on a, on a good note or they're just gonna continue just crap anyways see you guys later peace